With the debt ceiling crisis and showdown is going down to the wire. And there is still no deal on the table. Our DC Bureau Chief Ben Kennedy is live at the White House with this developing story. Ben. Nicole and Calvin, the holdup is on spending, what to cut, what to freeze, as both sides try and reach some sort of a compromise on a deal. The American people deserve to know. President Joe Biden in the Rose Garden Thursday. It's there he addressed the ongoing debt standoff. There will be no default. And it's time for Congress to act now. But Congress is heading into recess for the holiday weekend amid their efforts to resolve the stalemate ahead of a critical deadline set by the Treasury, saying in one week the U.S. could run out of money to pay its bills. There's a lot, couple of issues still hanging out there that we got to get done. We're going to work 24-7 to try to make that happen. His remarks come as one of the major credit rating agencies, Fitch, has put the U.S.'s AAA credit rating on a negative watch, a bit of a warning that the nation's top-ranked credit is at risk. When these negotiations happen, both sides have to understand that neither side is going to get everything that they want. Republicans want spending cuts and impose stricter work requirements for some federal aid programs, as Democrats are now on board with the GOP demands to reclaim unspent COVID funds. It does appear increasingly likely that House Republicans want a dangerous default. And if Congress does happen to hash out a deal, it will take time to write that bill and then three days for lawmakers to read and review before a vote. Reporting live at the White House, Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News.